more banks are now participating on the new SBA Direct PPP forgiveness portal. Actually, almost 300 more banks compared to last week have now entered and, and said that they will participate on the new SBA PPP Direct Forgiveness Portal, meaning that you, um, if your bank is participating in this new SBA program, you can apply for your PPP loan forgiveness now directly with the SBA and not through the lender or bank that gave you the PPP funds. That's what we're going to talk about in this video. Hello from Freedom Tax Accounting. We're an accounting firm where we have been providing quality tax and accounting services now for over 20 years. If you're new to this channel, we provide strategies for small business owners so they can achieve their financial goals. So if that's something that you're interested in, like and subscribe to our channel. Now, this video is being recorded on uh, August uh, 3rd in 2021. We always emphasize the date on the recording on any PPP video because this program has been constantly changing, okay? Now, if you have been following our channel, you know that two weeks ago, we said that the SBA was planning on launching a new portal that directly with the SBA that you were able to now apply for your PPP loan forgiveness and that you did not have to apply for PPP forgiveness via the bank or lender that gave you the loan. Now, last week, the SBA did launch the portal page. This is the page. This is the login page for the new SBA PPP direct forgiveness portal. Uh, we will provide a link to this page on the description of this video to, so you have access to it. Now, in order for you to use to be able to use this portal, your PPP loan has to uh, has two requirements. First requirement is that your PPP loan must be $150,000 or less and that your bank or lender that gave you the PPP loan is participating with the SBA on this new portal. Why? Because not every bank or lender is participating on this new SBA Direct Forgiveness Portal, and these banks that are not participating with SBA, they have their own PPP Forgiveness Portal, and you are going to have to apply through their portal, okay? Now, last week, the SBA uh, released a 600, uh, a list of 600 banks that were participating on this new program, but last night they released a new list where an addition, almost 300 new banks are now participating on this program. If you want to know how to find out or, or have access to this list, basically you go, um, go to the SBA homepage. Okay, this is the SBA homepage and you scroll down where it says Paycheck Protection Program you click learn more, then you scroll down where it says PPP loan forgiveness, learn more, you scroll down and here it says, see, list of lenders participating in direct forgiveness. You go there and here on this red button, you download the list and this is the new list. Now, last week, this list had 600 banks. This new list has, see, this new list has 887 banks. So that's almost an additional 300 banks that are now participating on the PPP Direct Forgiveness Portal. So download this list see if the bank or lender that gave you the PPP loan is on this list. And if your PPP is $150,000 or less and your bank or lender is on that list, then you may apply for forgiveness via the new SBA Direct Forgiveness Portal. Okay, so Thank you for watching this video. I hope it has been of value to you and your business. If it has, share it with other business owners and like it. 
Remember to subscribe to our channel. And also remember that we are praying for you, praying for your family, and praying for your business, okay? Thank you for watching. God bless you. Bye-bye.